Welcome to Infigyan. Today in this video, we have one very very interesting question from Algebra. We have to find all possible 6 real solutions of the hexic equation x square plus 3x plus 2 times x square minus 7x plus 12 times x square minus 2x minus 1 plus 24 equal to 0. Here x belongs to real numbers. So let's get started by factoring these two brackets first. So we can write here x square plus 3x can be written as x plus 2x. Then we have plus 2. In other bracket we will write x square minus 7x can be written as minus 3x minus 4x plus 12. Then we can write x square minus 2x minus 1. Then we have plus 24 equal to 0. Now we will take x common from here, 2 common from here, x common from these two and minus 4 common from these two. We will get x times x plus 1 plus 2 times x plus 1. Here we will be writing x times x minus 3. And minus 4 is common in the bracket. We will write x minus 3 once again. Then we have x square minus 2x minus 1 plus 24 equal to 0. Now we will factor x plus 1 times x plus 2 times x minus 3 times x minus 4 times x square minus 2x minus 1 plus 24 equal to 0. Now we are going to multiply these two brackets and these two brackets all together. So I can write here x plus 1 times x minus 3 which we will multiply and then we will multiply x plus 2 with x minus 4. Then we have x square minus 2x minus 1 plus 24 equal to 0. Let's multiply. We will get x square minus 3x plus x minus 2x. 1 times minus 3 minus 3. Then we will multiply these two and write x square minus 4x plus 2x minus 2x. 2 times minus 4 minus 8. Then we have x square minus 2x minus 1. Then we have plus 24 equal to 0. Now x square minus 2x, x square minus 2x, x square minus 2x. So let us say x square minus 2x. Suppose this is equal to u. So we can write one cubic equation in u. u minus 3 times u minus 8 times u minus 1 plus 24 equal to 0. Now we will solve this cubic equation first. Let me write here u minus 3 times u minus 8 times u minus 1 plus 24 equal to 0. Now we will write u minus 3 and then we will multiply these two brackets and write u square minus 9u plus 8 plus 24 equal to 0. Now we will expand with u minus 3 and we can write u cube minus 9u square plus 8u minus 3u square plus 27u minus 24 plus 24 equal to 0. Now plus 24 and minus 24 will be 0. 
we will write u cube minus 9u square minus 3u square minus 12u square 8u plus 27u 35u equal to 0. Now we can take u common out. So in the bracket we can write u square minus 12u plus 35 equal to 0. Now we will apply product 0 rule. So we can write either u equal to 0 or u square minus 12u plus 35 equal to 0. Now we have to solve both the equations. So we will begin with u equal to 0 and u square minus 12u plus 35 equal to 0. u square minus 12u plus 35 equal to 0 and u equal to 0. Let's solve this quadratic equation first. We will write u square minus 12u. We can split minus 7u minus 5u plus 35 equal to 0. Now from first two terms we can take u common. From last two we will take minus 5 common. So u is common in the bracket we can write u minus 7. Minus 5 is common in the bracket we can write u minus 7 equal to 0. So our factors would be u minus 5 and u minus 7 equal to 0. Again we will apply product 0 rule. We can write either u minus 5 equal to 0 or u minus 7 equal to 0. So from here you will get u equal to 5. And from this equation we will write u equal to 7. And here we have u equal to 0. So we can write three solutions for u. u equal to 0, u equal to 5, u equal to 7. Now u was our substitution x square minus 2x. So we can write x square minus 2x equal to 0, 5, 7. Let us consider three equations x square minus 2x equal to 0, x square minus 2x equal to 5, x square minus 2x equal to 7. So here we will take x common in the bracket we can write x minus 2 equal to 0. So using product 0 rule we can write x equal to 0 or x equal to 2. So we have first two real solutions x equal to 0 and x equal to 2. Now we have to solve second equation x square minus 2x minus 5 equal to 0. Now we are going to use quadratic formula. So if I will write formula first x equal to minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4 times ac divided by 2 times a. As per our equation we can write a equal to 1, b equal to minus 2 and c is constant minus 5. Now we have to plug in all the values of a, b and c in this formula. We will get minus b. So minus of minus 2 plus 2 plus minus the square root of b square is minus 2 square value will be 4 minus 4 times 1 times minus 5. So value will be 4 times 5 20 over 2 times 1 2. So we can write 2 plus minus the square root 24 over 2. Let me write here x equal to 2 plus minus square root 24 over 2. So I can write here 2 plus minus 2 root 6 over 2. So we are going to get other two real values 1 plus minus square root of 
6. Now we will consider our third equation x square minus 2x equal to 7 or we can write x square minus 2x minus 7 equal to 0. We can use completing the square method here as we have coefficient of x e1. So I can write here x square minus 2x and minus 7 will be written in the right hand side. So 7. Now we are going to add 1 to both sides. So let me write here plus 1. So in the RHS we will add plus 1 or we will write plus 1. So LHS will give us one perfect square of x minus 1 and RHS is 8. I will write x minus 1 whole square equal to 8 and 8 can be written as 2 square root 2 whole square. So we have x minus 1 whole square equal to 2 square root 2 whole square. Now we will take square root both sides and we can write x minus 1 equal to plus minus 2 square root 2. By adding 1 to both sides, we are going to get our last two real solutions 1 plus minus 2 square root 2. So we have in total 6 solutions. If I will write x 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Then our first two solutions were 0 and 2. Next two solutions were 1 plus minus square root 6. And last two are here 1 plus minus 2 square root 2. So we have 6 solutions of this hexig equation challenge. I hope friends you will like this. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care. Bye bye.